Hey guys, my name is Chaotic and in today's Grand Theft Auto 5 video, I'm going to be showing you how to get the aircraft carrier in GTA 5 Online without playing the heist mission. So what you can do is access this aircraft carrier by playing a new modded capture mission which was made by Carlos Cod HD. And if you want to obtain this capture mission for yourselves, you can of course go ahead and do so by clicking the link in the description to the social club and then bookmarking this job to your account. Now unfortunately this mission is only available for the PlayStation 3 and the PlayStation 4, but hopefully an Xbox alternative will be available very soon. But anyway, once you bookmark this mission to your account, you can of course go ahead and load it up from your bookmark jobs, and once inside the mission menu, you'll have to invite a friend into the mission, as it requires at least two people to start it up. But once you have done so and you spawn in, you'll spawn on the beach, and from here then you'll have two choices to make your way to the aircraft carrier. The first choice of course is to use the hydro jets, which are on the beach next to you, and you can of course then fly over to the aircraft carrier location. What you can also do is kill yourself, and by doing so, you'll respawn on the aircraft carrier. Now if you do choose to fly over there, there is in fact a marker on the map, so if you're not too sure of the location, just simply make your way to the marker and you'll find the aircraft carrier. But of course, once you're on the aircraft carrier, you're free to do whatever you want and go wherever you want, and if you weren't already aware, it is a huge ship which has a number of different levels on it, which you can of course also access. Now I know it's disappointing that Rockstar didn't add the aircraft carrier into free roam, in fairness it would have been a really cool addition to the game, but even so you can still have some fun with the aircraft in this modded capture mission, and I guess if you wanted to, you could also have a mini team deathmatch with some of your friends. I'm sure in the very near future we'll see a lot more modded missions in GTA 5 Online that include the aircraft carrier, but for now, this is the only one available. Now there's one very quick thing which I want to mention, if you're trying to bookmark this job to your account but you're having issues with the social club, maybe it says this mission cannot be found or it takes you to the wrong job, do not worry, it's because the social club is a little bit glitchy. So what you want to do is make sure the correct console is selected, so either the PlayStation 3 or the PlayStation 4 because they're the only consoles this job works on, and once you select the correct console, close the tab and then re-click the link in the description, and this time when you reopen it, it should work for you, and you can of course then go ahead and bookmark this job to your account. But anyway, with that being said, I do hope you guys have enjoyed this video, and I also hope you guys have some fun with this modded mission. I also want to give a very quick shout out to 0.4 Live, because this is his gameplay. I unfortunately do not have a PlayStation 4, so if you guys could go ahead and check out his channel, it would be greatly appreciated. There will be a link in the description to it. If you guys could also take a few seconds out of your day to click the like button, it would help me out a lot and it's also greatly appreciated. Also be sure to leave a comment on this video to let me know your thoughts about this modded mission. And if you have not subscribed to my YouTube channel already, I'd recommend that you do, because I upload all the latest and the greatest Grand Theft Auto 5 content. So once again, thank you guys for watching, and I will see you guys next time.